Hey Capricorn, welcome to my channel, Blessings of Love. My name is BB, and I'm here to do your weekly reading for May the 17th through the 23rd. And let's get right into it, Capricorn. I hope you guys are doing well. And starting off, you have the Page of Earth, the Four of Earth, the Eight of Air, the Four of Water, Empathy, Pride, Imagination, Forgiveness, and for your love cards, you have flirt, healing, family issues, and engagement. All right, so starting off, there's going to be some good news about financial matters. Some of you guys may want to do something that is a little bit more challenging. Some of you guys may consider learning a new skill or going back to school. Um, whatever it is, success is guaranteed. There's going to be guaranteed success in whatever this new idea is that you're having um i definitely expect some good news to come in about finances this week or about your career um i feel like some of you guys may have may get offered an opportunity this week but you don't see it being something of value you don't see it being a good opportunity i want to say remain open this week because what you may think is not a good opportunity or if it's something that you don't think will be good for you really take time to look at it again because i feel like you guys may overlook a big blessing for you this week um and with the four of earth um i feel like some of you guys are some of you guys are really holding back when it comes to business or love or some of you guys are being very careful or very cautious about how you're spending money or whatever new business ideas that you are having some of you are being very careful about the decisions you're making right now when it comes to finances which is understandable but i feel like you guys can open up a little bit more and take chances and that's clarified by pride i love myself and i see myself in everyone so yes with pride and the fourth earth some of you guys are really being closed off to new opportunities or some of you may think not for everyone but some of you may think i'm too good for that or i'm too good for this person or i'm too good for this job but please put your pride to the side and know that this opportunity or whatever it is it will lead to recognition and reward all right and for the eight of air an illusion of being trapped a lack of self-confidence afraid to take action now for some of you some of you may feel like you don't deserve this opportunity or you're not worthy of having this opportunity or whatever this good good news is that comes in some of you may be afraid or some of you may lack the confidence to take action on what's being presented to you you have to get out of that mindset of lack you have to let go of the mindset of you know i can't do it or i don't know if it's right for me know that god would getting would not give you anything that you cannot handle and i feel like the reason why you're being gifted this opportunity because you've worked so hard because you put in a lot of effort and now it's time for you to reap the reward so this week you know shift your mindset from being you know fearful for being oh i don't know if i'm good enough and start to think positive start to see you know what it's meant for me to have this opportunity. It's meant for me to have this love. It's meant for me to have this job. As I feel like you guys, you're on the right path this week. And you're going to have success. But it just may, for some of you, you may, have, you may need to shift your mindset. And lastly, with the fourth order, missing an opportunity, discontentment, or boredom, open your eyes to the possibilities. Yes, again remain open as you can this week because i feel like some of you guys may feel like i don't know if this is for me i don't know if i can do it but really just have faith and believe and the more the more open you are and the more that you have faith know that there is something good coming for you know that there's something good that is manifesting for you and that's clarified by forgiveness i acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love now if some of you guys are being prideful if some of you guys are holding on to the past 
forgive whoever you need to forgive and don't allow it to block any opportunities that are coming in for you this week. Again, open your heart, forgive, remain open so that your blessings are not blocked, that you get what you deserve. And that's clarified by good fortune. So again, get out of the mindset of like, let go of the mindset that you're not good enough for some of you. I just feel like if you really open up to whatever is being presented to you this week, if it seemed like something small or something that you wouldn't go for, give it a chance because I feel like it's going to help you in the long run. It's going to help you to have stability with good fortune and guaranteed success. I feel like this opportunity is going to have a good outcome. Now, when it comes to love, you have the cards of flirt. Healing family issues and engagement. Now, when it comes to love, some of you may, some of you guys may be holding on to past hurt. Some of you guys need to heal family issues and forgive so that it doesn't block any of any new opportunity. So it doesn't block a love opportunity. Because I feel like with the engagement card, there is the possibility for your relationships to go to the next level. Or it is a possibility for you to meet someone and it turns into a serious relationship, but you have to work on healing your family issues. You have to work on.